Yo at everyone a new major update for software inc just dropped. Let's start by making it clear, this update isn't anything huge like beta 1, but it revamps a few sections of the game. Most notably, distribution has received a complete overhaul and the bottom bar UI got a little redesign. Yet, yeah, there were some bug fixes but who cares about them, so let's see what these changes bring. Looking at the bottom of the screen here, you can see there's an entirely new section called logistics, here, You'll find the old distribution window has now been split into two sections, manufacturing and digital distribution. The utilities tab has been moved from the finances window to this new section as well as the servers window. Only one of these features received a revamp, and it's digital distribution. The old menu has been almost entirely thrown into the bin, with new features being plastered over the window. Starting now, every company can have its own digital distribution platforms where they take a cut of the sales. Don't worry, you can avoid paying exorbitant fees by only selecting cheaper platforms to have your products sold in. If you want to completely circumvent third parties altogether, you can develop your own distribution store, where you can take cuts out of other companies seeking to sell their products in your store. Though in this update, starting your own distribution platform requires you to actually develop your own service with unique features. They don't seem to take very long to develop, but I would advise you to take the time to complete a fourth design iteration, since you'll likely be depending on that platform for a long time. You have to also maintain your distribution platform with regular updates as you need to fix bugs and keep your tech levels up to date, along with getting some servers to keep the whole thing running of course. Once you are ready to release your digital service, just release it as you would with any product and you will start to gain users slowly. Once you reach a large enough market share, You'll even be able to sign exclusivity deals with other companies to only sell their products on your distribution platform, though this comes at a hefty fee. Some other changes include ISP costs being reduced to make running a distribution platform cheaper, adding quick confirmations if you're trying to leave the game when you haven't saved in the last minute, a warning that tells you is too expensive and is losing sales, and some other fixes with customer behavior. And that's pretty much it. If you'd like to try out this update, just switch to the testing branch by right-clicking the game in your Steam library, clicking Properties, selecting Beta, and choosing the appropriate Beta branch. Otherwise, just wait a few weeks for all the bugs to be fixed and be rolled out to the public branch. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.